When drawing within SoftPlan, one of the things that makes the program so efficient is the ability to draw with objects, whether it be walls, windows, uh, symbol blocks, cabinets, etc. These, in turn, are used to facilitate the generation of elevations, 3D models, and cut lists. A zoom in and edit of this wall will demonstrate that it has a plate height of 8 feet. Uh, vertically, it has an offset of 6 inches, and selecting the definition, we can see all of the wall materials that are used in the wall definition, and even such things as stud spacing. This is all important information to the soft plan designer and builder. Obviously, there are times that arise when this file itself needs to be exported, and we don't want to lose the three-dimensional information that is used to generate these elevations, 3D texture models, and cut list. The demonstration part of this video will now show you taking this file out of SoftPlan as a DWG format. Um, at that stage, changes could be made to the floor plan, and then we would want to bring it back into SoftPlan while maintaining all of the object-oriented properties of SoftPlan. Selecting File and Export in DWG version 2000, the file can now be exported. Typing in the file name and export, the file would now be taken out of SoftPlan, layers automatically created as it associates to the uh, walls, windows, etc., and then opened up within the AutoCAD world. At this stage, this file could then be opened up in the AutoCAD world. Modifications or even drawing can be done using their tools to the actual floor plan. Layers would be created, associated with the various objects within the plan for walls, windows, etc. To bring in the soft plan file to a new drawing, we'll simply select File, New Drawing, and then File and Import. The DWG file can then be imported at this stage. Now, there is no drawing on SoftPlan or on the drawing screen at this stage. So what we're looking to do is use the original SoftPlan data, which is to say bring in the walls as walls, not as lines, the openings as openings with dimensions, etc. This uh, as runs counter to, say, ignoring the soft plan data, which is we would ignore the um, object uh, properties of the walls and simply bring it in as, as, a, as a line plan, or the modifications only, which is simply the changes made within the AutoCAD world. With Use Original Soft Plan Data selected, we'll select to import. On import, we can see the details of the information that was brought in and a simple edit of the same wall will show us it's a 2 by 6 brick wall and not lines with a plate height of 9 feet and if you were to drill deeper you would be able to see that it's got the stud spacing and all of the same wall definitions as previously shown. This allows the best of all worlds the ability to use SoftLens automation to efficiently design plans elevations, three-dimensional models, as well as cut lists, and the ability to export it for engineering that maybe need to be done on the plan, round-tripping that back to SoftPlan to maintain the automation.